to be entered for our September giveaway for an Ultra Pro Burning Shadows Pokemon binder and nine random Pokemon cards. All you have to do is make sure you like this video, click that subscribe button, and answer our question of the day. Hi guys, Pokey Sisters here. This is Katie, and today we're going to be looking at some things that have been announced for the Pokemon TCG. So let's go ahead and take a look. First off, we're going to look at Japanese's uh, Crimson Invasion set, their Sun Moon 4, Awoken Hero, and their Trans Dimensional Beast. Um, we're not going to go through this in too much depth, um, but this is basically going to be our uh, Crimson Invasion. And um, most of the, I think most of or all of the regular set has been um, kind of leaked and revealed. So uh, maybe we'll take a, we'll just take a second. We'll go through here and I'll point out cards that I personally like. So. Um, and maybe we'll take a look at the hollows, but feel free to go to Pokey Beach and look this up for yourself if you're more interested. But it looks like we're going to be getting a Go Goat hollow. Very nice. Like the looks of that one. Ooh, I really, really like the artwork on this Marowak. By the way, I have not like looked at any of this yet, so I am. This is like my first reaction of these cards. So uh, the Marowak looks very nice. Oh, let's keep going. Let's around the camera up in this set. Oops. Um. See artillery, core fish. Seems like it's been a while since we had him. Shellos, very nice. Here is the Alolan Golem GX, which I believe I showed in the last um kind of update video. Very nice, very nice. Can I have another Emolga. Been a while since we've seen Emolga in a set. Oh man, this Gengar looks sweet. Oh, definitely gonna want that Hollow. That that card looks awesome. Uh, let's see. Ugh. Okay, we've got. Let's see, we're gonna get a Gore guys. Ooh, a Salazzle Psychic type Polo. Ooh, I love it. There's so many of them. That that card looks nice. Love that one. Um, let's see what else. Um, here's the Fuzzle GX. Sorry guys, if you just heard that, my cat is being really, really dumb. I'll turn it to you. I'm sorry. Uh, but here we'll take a look at this card. There it is, Fuzzle GX. As you can see, we already do have the English um, look of that card, so that is very cool. It's an Ultra Beast. If you guys were unaware. Um, looks like we're gonna have a Maw while. Ooh, Aaron and Laron. We haven't had like Agron's line in a while. That Agron is gonna be a hollow. Very nice. Love the looks of that card as well. Oh gosh, we have Registeel. Does that mean all of the Regis are gonna be in the set? I hope not. Because that just means they're gonna be regular rares in English. And bleh. um, looks like we're gonna have a Kartana GX. Here's a look of this one. That that's interesting. Again, it looks like it's an Ultra Beast GX card. Um, yeah, I don't know how I feel about the artwork on that card. Um, I mean, it kind of looks cool, I guess. Let's see, you've got Stravia, Straptor. Yep, here's Regigigas. He's a hollow, though, so he won't be a regular rare. Um, kind of a cool artwork, though. I like it. like the perspective on that one. Let's see what else we've got. We've got Cinchino's line. Ooh, looks like we're going to have a Type Null hollow. There's a look at that one. Very interesting looking there. And then we have a Silvalli GX. I actually really do like the artwork on this card quite a bit. Um, looks really nice. Uh, right, and it looks like we've got a ton of trainers. Looks like, ooh, peeping red card. That is different than red card. It says, look at your opponent's hand. Um, you may have your opponent count the number of cards in their hands, shuffle their hand into their deck, and then draw that many cards. Interesting. Um, Psychic Memory. I'm not going to go through these in too much depth, um, but here... Um, all of the full arts and, like, hyper rares and stuff has, have not been revealed yet, but um, here's the Silvalli GX full art. Really like that card. Um, it looks really cool with this kind of blue outline. I really do like that card. Looks nice. And, ah, one of my bays right here. We have Gladian. Very cool. I can't wait to get this one. Really love the red and the blue on there. I, I know I've seen this one. I think I saw it on Twitter um, a little while ago, but definitely an awesome looking card. Going to be nice to add that one to the bay collection. Alright, so here is the um, second set in Japan, but it will all be in our Crimson Invasion, I would assume. It looks like we're going to have a bee drill. Is that a hollow? Nope, it's not. Let's see what else we got. we got. Execute. Ooh, I love the artwork on that Magikarp. And then there's this absolutely beautiful Gyarados GX, which we have shown before. Very awesome looking card there. It's like we have the Mamoswine line. Sarah will be happy about that one. We have Phoebus and Milotic. Um, this is kind of reminiscent of the the artwork for me back from the one in X and Y. Um, but really pretty card. 
All right, here's Reg Ice. So we do indeed have the Reggies, um, but two of them are hollows, one of them's not. But here's the Reg Ice. Looks actually really too like that work on that card quite a bit. Love the background on that one. Oh, we got Pikachu. We have an Alolan Raichu hollow. Very cute. Love the hibiscus and the palm trees in the background there. Um, we got on um, the Miss Magius line. Oh, we have Grumpig and Spoink. Sarah's so gonna be happy about those as well. Ooh, ooh, look at this Oranguru. Psychic type Oranguru. That looks sweet. Why isn't that card a hollow? That would be a gorgeous hollow. Definitely a cool looking artwork there. Um, nah. Pelego GX. I'm probably pronouncing this wrong, but I know it looks like a looks like a jellyfish. It's an Ultra Beast card. Very cool looking there. Um, just interesting. Basically a jellyfish. What it looks like to me. Let's see what else we've got. Oh, uh, we have more pigs. We have um the primate blinds here. will again be happy. There's tons of pigs in this set. Um, here's Reg Rock. Yep, we're definitely got the Reggies going on. Um, ooh, we have a fighting type beware. Very interesting. Um, don't know if I'm a huge fan of the artwork on that card, but um, nice to see Beware as a fighting type. Looks like we've got, ooh, Houndoom and Houndour. So we've also got, we got a High Dragon Hollow. Um, not, not sure how I feel about the artwork on that card either. I don't know, not my favorite. Compared to some of the others, but it's not terrible. We have a Guzzlord GX. There's the English version. Again, it's an Ultra Beast card. Very, very cool um, looking card there. Well, let's see what else we've got. Ooh, we got Jigglypuff and Wigglytuff. Ooh, we got this Xerneas. Um, kind of blurry. I can't tell if that's a hollow. I think it kind of looks like one, but I really like the artwork on that one. We've got the Alolan Executor GX. That just looks funny, but for some reason I really love that card. Can't wait to see the full art on that card. I think it'll be kind of funny. But um, let's see what else we've got. We've got Komoo Hollow. Oh, um, that's an interesting artwork. I actually kind of like that one. Pretty cool, I don't know. I like it though. Oh, we got Mill Tank. Ooh, this swab blue looks really, really nice. Really like that one. Um, and then we got our trainers. And then we've got the Guzzlord GX Fort, which looks beautiful. I love the backgrounds. So that blue looks really cool with that texture. And then we have Luzamine. Luzamine. I'm sorry, I'm probably pronouncing that wrong, but uh, full art right there. So very cool. Obviously, there will still be some more cards to come with the full arts and stuff, but there's a pretty solid look at what those sets are going to look like and pretty much what our Crimson Invasion set, I would assume, is going to look like as well. So very, very cool. Can't wait to see those cards come out. I'm um, sorry that kind of took longer than I expected, but I haven't looked at them yet. So I kind of got caught up in looking, but here is a Shining Legends collection, Raichu GX in, Raichu GX in January. Um, let's see, so it looks like uh, it's going to be a collection box that will come with a full art Raichu GX foil promo card, a jumbo version of the same card. So this card won't be in our set, but there's a look at that card for you guys if you haven't seen it before. Very cool looking. Alright, I know there's a Zoroark box, which we will get down to. Ooh, we've got a Guzzlord GX box in January. Let's see what this is all about. Alright, so there's the card. It says they'll come with a foil promo of Guzzlord GX, a jumbo version of the same card, four booster packs, and a code card. So basically just your normal GX collection box. It'll probably be 20 bucks. Um, very cool. And I think there's either one or two more things. I'm pretty sure, yep, we're just going to look here at this um, Shining Legends Zorwa GX collection box, which was um, announced, the looks of it, so... We'll look at the picture first here. That looks sweet. Honestly, it looks so awesome. Looks like there's three, four, five packs. Um, the full art. Looks like we got a full art promo. That'll probably be hollow foil. And then we get a coin. So the only thing that's not really in there is a pin as far as um, it looks. But let's read. So, um, <laughs> yeah, I don't think I really need to read that. But if you guys see something important, feel free to say something. But here's a look at that full art Zoroark. Looks very, very cool. Um, definitely see a really cool box. My guess is it will retail. I don't see where it says anything, but my guess is $30 for five packs. So maybe like probably 30 or 40 bucks would be my guess anyway. Um, it looks like that's going to be coming out November 3rd. Very nice, very nice. So I think that's the last thing that I had to look at. Yeah. Oh, yeah. No, 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 no. There is one more thing. Um, we do have to look at these really, really cool... 
uh, promo cards. Um, it's a P Pikachu and a Mimikyu, and they, they look nice. I really do like them. So there's the Mimikyu. Um, looks nice. I know a lot of people are a fan of Mimikyu. And then this Pikachu looks really cool as well. So, um, again, don't really know. It says currently there are no English products that feature the cards. So, um, my guess is, like they said, it'll be in a Crimson Invasion uh, Blister Pack promos. Um, that'll be cool. I think those will be cool uh, Blister Pack promos. I'll definitely want to get them both. Um, they're really cool, and I think that they will be fan favorites as well. So, I think that about does it. Um, also, I'm not going to pull this up, but for Crimson Invasion, the theme decks are going to be como -O and High Dragon, which will mean that those will probably not be hollows in our English set. So, that just about does it. Um, definitely was really cool to look at what Crimson Invasion is going to look at, but or look like, but I am super excited um, for all this new stuff that's coming out. Make sure you guys let me know what you're most looking forward to. That'll be the question today. Um, but if you guys watched all this, thank you. Make sure you guys leave it a big thumbs up, click that subscribe button, and may the polls be ever in your favor.